I'm hungry. Grab my phone and my wallet. This might surprise you. In fact, it could come as a complete shock, but I'm not perfect. And sometimes my life gets busy. I lose track of you know, how much energy and time I have in a day, and I make compromises. Sometimes I eat fast food, and I'm gonna do that today, but you know what? In the interest of science, we're gonna do a little experiment. We're gonna see how long it takes me to go get some fast food. So the clock is already running. I'm gonna jump in my very beat up old station wagon. Plant the camera right here. And let's drive and get some fast food. So, as you can see, we're checking out how long it takes for me to get in my car, drive to the fast food place, wait in line, order my food, pay for my food, and pick up my food and take it home to my table. Now, in a moment, we're going to time how long it takes for me to make a simple salad from things I have at home. Simple, yeah, but complete. Something filling. Something that's going to fill me up and get me through my day and not leave me hungry. A complete meal. We'll account for the shopping time and all that, but for now, it looks like I'm about home, so so I need to stop talking and let me talk. Okay, let's eat. All right, 24 minutes, 11 seconds. Next, we're gonna see how long it takes me to make a simple but filling salad. Now, to be fair, it does take some time to go to the grocery store and get the ingredients, fair enough. Most people do make a weekly grocery run regardless, but just for argument's sake, I can tell you that it takes me about 15 minutes round trip and to buy the things for this salad would be about another 15 minutes, but bear in mind, that'll be enough for about four salads. It'll also take me about five minutes to wash all my produce and put it in my little veggie keeper, so just to make the math simple, let's call it 36 minutes. Divided by four meals, that's nine minutes. Then I need another minute to put my things away, wipe down the counter, so about an even 10 minutes, though again, most of us make a weekly grocery run anyway, so in the real world, it's probably more like a minute and a half. But for argument's sake, I'm going to give fast food the benefit of the doubt, so we'll add an even 10 minutes to whatever number we end up with. The salad is going to just be romaine, cucumber, radish, pecans, and smoked herring. Now, if that's not for you, then that's fine. Just do your own thing, of course. And if you do use a mandolin like I do, it saves a ton of time, but you need to be really careful because it's so easy to cut yourself, especially with the little radishes. So yeah, be careful. All right, let's give it a whirl. I'm hungry. Let's eat. And there you have it. Two minutes, 55 seconds. We can even round that up to three minutes. Add another 10 to account for buying and washing our ingredients, and it's still only 13 minutes, and that is 11 minutes faster than the so-called fast food. Now, I do have to mention that a lot of people live in food deserts where they don't have reasonable access to a grocery store while surrounded by fast food and convenience stores. It's a really serious problem and it needs to be addressed. So, does this work for everybody every time? Sadly, no. The world just is not that equitable, unfortunately. But, if you have the choice, and I do hope you have a choice, then you should be aware of the fact that fast food isn't even fast, so do not kid yourself. You have options. And of course, you likely don't want a salad for every meal every day, but this is just one example. I've already shown you a few tricks, but I'm going to keep posting more videos on the Fast, Easy, Healthy, Cheap playlist to show you ways that you can do better than the drive through you really don't have to do that to yourself, and I hope you'll keep watching, so do make sure to smash all the things, you know, like like and subscribe and comment and all those wonderful, easy and free things that will help me help you help me help you. Got it? Okay, good. But for now, it's time to wrap up this video. Thanks so much for watching. I hope to see you next time. Ciao.